All right, boys and girls, I want to thank you all for coming along and enjoying the little uh, festivities we got going on. Today, we are going to do what is called a soap test. A lot of questions about the Ruger Impact Max. And the Ruger Impact Max N22 is your general purpose, regular old, big box, break barrel gun. The question was, does it have the capability of having enough power to take down a small game? We're going to run it through a couple of bars of soap and... That should give us the information that we need to give you either a good to go or a hell no. Now, there are some people out there who are telling me that they've used the Ruger Impact Max to take down medium game coyotes uh, at 50 yards. Uh, I'm probably going to say no, not to mention uh, the my, my opinion this gun doesn't have the accuracy for 50 yards. And if you watch the previous video about my indoor accuracy test, you will see. So... Continue on, enjoy the soap test, stay tuned, and we'll both find out what's going on. We're going to see what kind of penetrative power the Ruger Impact Max has, and if it can penetrate not one, but two bars of soap. I'm going to go with seven yards, because that's what uh, that is. That's what our best results are. We're going to see if we can't knock it off the top of the box there. Seven yards, soap test, Ruger Impact Max. All right, I'm gonna try her again. Seven yards, soap test, Ruger Impact Max. And we'll see where she goes this time. Well, let's take a look. All right. Let's see if we can't make it move for the mailbox. Nice one. Set her up one more time. The open air environment is a little bit different. And I'm going to go for that middle one just for shits and grabs. See if we can't make her drop off the whole way. See what she did. All right, so here's your continuation of the soap test. What we did is we just uh, went down to the dollar store, got ourselves some soap. So this is to see if the Ruger Impact Max, the brake barrel itself, can penetrate enough to dispatch small game humanely. So what do we got? We got the uh, Redneck Ballistic Gel. We got about a bar of soap that's almost about an inch thick, and we put two of those together. So I shot the front side three times, and shot the back side twice. We were in an open air environment, wind's blowing like hell, so to speak. So let us just see what we got. It looks like on my, second, on my back shots here, so we have that. One of them went through. The other one is still in there. So we have some kind of penetration on that. Take our handy dandy pocket knife, if you will. And make it naked. Boom. So we shot the backside. 
one of them actually went through. I mean, it's the skinnier edge of the bar of soap. It came out the other side somewhere and penetrated full on. And it looks like it went through the top of that also. So that actually penetrated full on and went through. Front side of this, all the way through and through. Those two did not make it through. And I just heard soap and other things dropping. All right. There is our pellet. So it came right through here, as you can tell. Stopped right in the top. It almost made it through an inch. Didn't, uh, didn't open up at all. There's the other one. Oh, that one opened up quite nicely. Look at that one. That thing there, let's just say it worked as advertised. And it's the same, it's the same brand of pellet, it's the same pellet. That's, that there, boys and girls, is interesting. That's what it's supposed to do. That's what it's supposed to, to break out and hit that kinetic shock trauma that actually uh, euthanizes the animal quickly. Um, this failed to open up. Let's see what the other ones look like. So those are all now through and through. So the Ruger Impact Max has the capability of going through a medium such as this. So that means it will penetrate skin. Now this one obviously was uh, shot from the backside here and didn't make it all the way through. But let's uh, let's take a look. Come to daddy. It kind of started to flatten out. Hmm, that's nice. That's nice. So, and the other one is nowhere to be seen. So it hit the corner and went off. I would tell you right now with my experience and training and all the other good stuff that goes with that. Look at that beautiful imprint that you got there. Yeah. I would say that the Ruger Impact Max, in the words of old Doug Makeda or whatever, it will kill. I am just I'm just amazed on how that one there flattened out. And again, totally what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to open up like that and just create this flat space which moves the shock trauma through the body and effectively euthanizes the animal. Small game. So backyard plinking, small game. I would tell you the Ruger Impact Max, good right, to go. Boys, girls, well, shit. Now we know what the Ruger Impact Max will do to not one, but two bars of soap. And you see what happens when those pellets actually uh, exfoliate or expand how they are designed to do. That is, in my opinion, really awesome when the brand does what it's supposed to do and, and is doing what it's supposed to do. And, shows you how it's supposed to do it on the outside of the box and then presto changeo you got it so you know your job is now like subscribe go ahead leave comments down below if you have any questions go ahead and ask me all right hope you enjoyed it little island sniper action and we will see you boys and girls on the other side chuck big daddy meyer